guys welcome back to medieval dynasty i just kind of finished building on up the food storage looking lovely over here i think uh, what's his name uh manfred is, is enjoying the view so a little bit of difficulty building this overnight um yeah i actually had to empty out some of the food storage because when tearing down storage if you're tearing down a building and it's going to be below the uh, uh the kilograms you already got stored you got to empty it out and put it somewhere else. So I put a lot of the cabbage into the barn. It worked out nicely. Yeah, but we went from like 700 storage up to 1,500 storage. So wowzers, that worked out rather well. So well, I think I need to kind of tear down the other one and maybe get a second food storage going. Or we're going to keep that good enough for now. It is the second day of summer, year number seven. I do have one of the quests up that we have. And the uh, hunting quest is I got to kill 13... In total, bear, wolf, and boar. Um, I think the bison count as well. I probably should have my bow out here ready to go. I did have to chop some trees down around here because of, you know, logs and planks I was running low on. So I chopped the ones down around here. And while I was doing so, I got attacked by the boars that were around here. So I don't think there's going to be any boars around here whatsoever. Plus we have our... Oh, I, I, I stand corrected. Um... Yeah, our hunters are doing a well enough job, but we're going to head up to uh, Danica because I do have the two flax and, and, or the three flax, two wool quests to hand in. So I'll go ahead and get that all set, but there's another boar down. So 10 more boars, wolves, and bears to go. I got two days to do it in. Well, this day, this night, and tomorrow. I don't really have tomorrow night to get it undone. But we're going to head on over there. I did go ahead and grab some arrows. I probably should have actually gone back. You know what? Our food is doing well. Let's just leave my food the way it is. I thought about bringing some food over to sell. I don't think, um, with the amount of arrows I got, I'm probably going to make everyone broke over there. But if we come on down here to our fields, the fields are doing rather well. So well, I think they are pretty much done uh, for summer. As you can see, they're just like uh, talking to each other like, yeah, it looks great, doesn't it? So yeah, they got the cabbage all planted. The uh, onions that were here are all picked and harvested. Um, this will be wheat. Wheat will be planted again in autumn, I do believe. And of course, over here, this is a field full of flax, but it is not planting season. Yeah, flax is in the spring, I do believe, I think. Um, but yeah, we'll get the flax back online. So now, we're, like I said, we're going to head over to Danica to hand it in this uh, flax that we do have and the wool that we do have. Um, how much cash do I got on me? Twelve eighty-two. I'm wondering if I can get enough cash from all the arrows to go ahead and maybe buy another lamb. I know, I'm just thinking about wool. Uh, let's see, deer, I don't care about the deer. They do, not, they do not count towards my total. But we do know when we get over to Danica, there are some boars over there to take care of. Um, maybe a wolf or two I'll find in the, wo in the woods somewhere along the way. But uh, let's see what I run into here shortly. Well, as we get up near Danica, as we always know, there's always boars around here. Hopefully you just get attacked by one at a time. There's one there. Should be a couple more around here, because I haven't killed any boars around here. I am dirty. Oh, uh, great. They may not want to talk to me because I'm dirty. Oh, uh, why did that have to happen now? I just got up here. All right, so I don't know where the other boars are. Uh, wait, there's one right there. Might as well get a little bit more dirty. Plus get my uh, iron bolt back. Have plenty of iron arrows in my inventory, so hopefully, like I said, I can sell those, but now I'm dirty, so who knows? Who knows if they'll want to talk to me or not. And skin this one up, get some leather. I don't get no fur from a boar, do I? Which seems kind of weird since they do have a little bit of uh, fur on them. I don't think there's going to be another boar around here, but there might be. Usually they're in threes, so... But we'll skip along through here. And I forgot who has the quest, so let's go ahead into my journal. Get that one back up. We'll follow that one. And she is... Over here somewhere. Must be in her shop. Is it you? I don't think it's you, is it? No, it's not you. I thought it was you. 
Although I could have talked to her. Uh, who is it now? Uh, it's you. Um, relax. I got he uh, got it all here as promised. Fifteen reputation, a straw hat, two linen thread, and uh, some other things. But uh, that's all good. Um, yeah. Do I want to talk to some people today? Sure. Let's try. Get, let's give it a shot. Seventy uh, percent. Um, how's the job? Hope you're doing all right. Oh, you like that quite a bit. And how have you been lately? Uh, of course, still going on up. How's the job? Hope you're doing all right. Yeah, I'm repeating myself somewhat, but you know, it's all good. I'm creating some, it sounds like what I was looking for with pleasure. Oh, where are you going to move into? I did not think um, I had room for you. And just like that, he is gone. Alrighty then. Um, more people, that's fine because we got food. Just, uh, just wasn't sure where I want to put them. Just yet. We'll find some way, somewhere. Do I want to try storage? I mean, I don't need no one in the spithy. I guess I could maybe put him in sewing. I did not check his skills. I mean, I'm pretty much maxed out. I don't, I mean, maybe I can put him in the barn for just a little bit. Resource storage. Let, let's, let's see if I can figure out this. Let's put him in food storage. Assigned worker, storekeeper. Um, does that mean he will sell food? He does have three in crafting. I'm not sure here. Let me go to food stores three. If I go to here, profession storekeeper. I'm not really sure what he does. So does he actually sell things while he's there? Okay, so uh, 1432. Wait, did I sell anything? Did he, did he sell something already? Hang on a second. I gotta write this down. 1432. The problem is I'm going to try to sell some things around here. Um, all right. Let's go back in here. I don't think she has any money. Show me your wares. Yeah, she's only got two coins on her. Uh, I'll talk to you later. Um, that's gonna, just going to leave. I'm looking for him. Uh, he's probably out here in the field, right? Yeah, he's out here in the field. I don't know if he has any cash on him or not. 1432. I'm just keeping an eye on the cash now because I don't know if he's going to sell. Um, do you have... I don't... I may have taken all your cash as well. No, you got cash here. Here's some... Have some iron arrows. You probably need them because of all the boars. Um, so now I'm at... Better write this down. 2636. And actually, you know what? I'm probably going to go ahead and spend that right now. Uh, if you have a little lamb running around here. I don't think you do because I... Oh, no, you do. You do. You do. All right. Uh, come here, little fella. You're going to go in there. All right, so now that puts me down to 136. All right, I got numbers everywhere now. 136 coins. All right, I'm... Wait, did I sell... I still got 40 arrows on me, but there's no one else here to sell to. All right, where's my crossbow? And let's get up this journal and so I can keep this alive on me. 500... Yeah, 513. I'll never kill 513 uh, of those... Uh, so let's go on over here and let's see, where do I want to go next here? Um, whew. well, I mean, I guess I can, uh, Branica, what is the quest there that I said no to? Uh, I've been there a couple times and I did not accept the quest there. All right, well, we'll head over there and see what the quest is. May as well. I got to do a little hunting along the way. So it'll never hurt. So hopefully I'll run across a few things. And probably by the time I get there, I'll see if my... Because it says storekeeper, so that's kind of interesting. Uh, I got to angle more this way. That's easy enough. Just keep the lake and river on your left side, Peanut. Can you handle that? Maybe. Maybe not. Well, it's not a bear, but it is a bison, so I think this counts towards the hunt, because it said it does say bear on the list twice, but I think, um, I think, uh, these will kind of count. I don't like how both of them are kind of close to one another, but... Hit him in the head, so hopefully he's kind of slow, because I am slow as well. And maybe they don't count. Still at five, but since we're here, 
Don't charge me too fast. Yep, still at five, so these do not count. I wonder why they got bear on there twice. I mean, I'm pretty sure it's a typo or something like that. So I was just hoping that one was, wasn't supposed to be a bear. It was supposed to be a wisen slash bison or whatever. Oh, well, it doesn't hurt to harvest them up. They do give us plenty amount of fur and leather. So that doesn't quite count. So yeah, so it's just basically boars and wolves I can think of. All right, so we're not too far from being up here. I'm pretty sure I must have went ahead and checked to see what the side quest was while I was up here. I did cross the river behind me to go ahead and give a help. Blah, 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 blah. Words. I did cross the river behind me to give myself a good wash so I'm not too dirty. Uh, where are we here? Oh, I got to go. I got to go east. Yep, the exclamation point is now on the map, so I'll just go ahead and follow that. So maybe I'll go up and see um, Alwyn. i see if he's up there hunting in the northeast part of the map. Let me go ahead and put the bow away because I don't want to accidentally shoot someone. Although part of me would like to probably try it. Uh, you again? Uh, can I help you with something? Uh, a customer. I'm not sure if I'm buying... Wait, did I? I've already done this. Buying something from another village, are you? We, we just did this, didn't we? Are you going to make me do it again? <laughs> this seems kind of weird. Um, you don't seem... Okay, so we kind of know what this is all about. Uh, sorry, I don't have time for that. I don't feel like going back and forth on that. It's kind of weird that I'm getting the same quest again. Meanwhile, let's go ahead and let's talk to a couple more people. Approval lady, I'm creating new sentiment. Is he going to say yes? Sounds like what I was looking for, with pleasure. Where are you guys moving into? All right, if I go here, no, I, I don't know what, I don't know exactly what they're doing. I, I'm going to go ahead and put this guy <laughs> into what? I don't know. Um, let's go ahead and just put him into, geez, so I want him to go into sewing. I could. I think right now I'm just going to go ahead and just throw him into the barn. I don't think his, his skill work set is good. But he's in there. Uh, what's his, uh, actually he's a, he's a number three. He's a uh, skill level three. So that's one of his best qualities actually. So basically he's helping them make a uh, daub and flower and anything else. Um, oh, I know what they're moving into because I do have, I did have a house that was, yeah, we just built a house. I don't think I put anyone into it until now, until now. All right. So be it. He's in there. All right. Where's my bow? Got too many things going on back at the villas now. I can't keep track of it all. But I need 10 more boars and wolves. And the best place probably to get it right now from where I am is up here in the swamp area. A lot of boars. Uh, does not look like Alwyn or Sam. I forgot what his name is. Um, but yeah, the original hunters from Gostovia. Don't look like they're up there. But we're going to head that way anyways. See if I can take down some boars and some wolves. Get this side quest done because this is for one of my villagers. So I want to go ahead and get that done. Someone has a nice storage area out here. How nice. And hopefully no one steals from it. Well, we made it to the swamp plains. There's usually some boars in here. And last time I was in here hunting boars, they kind of came out of flipping nowhere and surprised the heck out of me. Hello, boars. I need to... Oh, well, hello. Okay, I do see three of them. Um, are you going to come after me? Or what are you doing there? Fine, sir. All right, those other two are far enough away. Let's go ahead and get our iron ore back. Plus meat slash leather. Yeah, that's it. Uh, I was trying to, trying to get something else out of it, but I can't. Yeah, don't you dare come over here yet. I'm not ready for you. Now we're ready for you. 
All right, there are two of you, and there you guys were pretty close to one another. Oh, I think I see the other one over there as well. Oh, wait. Uh, wait, they're fighting each other. <gasps> Actually, there's uh, another boar right there as well, I think. So they're attacking each other and killing each other. Uh, great, I hit that one. I was hoping to kill it before the other one does. There we go. So I'm not going to get credit for the one they already killed. Interesting. I think that's the first time I've seen the animals, the boars attack each other. We've seen the wolves attack each other. Kind of a bloody mess around here. Oh, I got to... Uh, okay, so it's 13. I thought it was, I thought it was 15. So 13... So they did kind of mention as well, like we said, uh, I think maybe in the next update there might be the challenges will be coming along. And they were talking about like what one of the challenges will be there's going to be like 20 wolves near your village. Do you accept a challenge or not? Uh, and either choice that you make will have uh, the way the the way the villagers look at you. So if you don't accept a challenge, maybe they won't uh, like you as much. The mood might go down. Who knows? So right now I'm kind of on a quest to kill 13, which is not too bad if you got three days to do it. So I don't know in a challenge, you got like one night to do it, because that would be really, really difficult. All right, so we're coming over here where Alwyn, his name was Alwyn, right? The, our best, well, he's supposed to be kind of like our best friend in a way. I don't think he's going to be over here. Sambor? Is it Sambor? Oh, and they built a second hut. Was, was, were both huts here before? I don't think so. Oh, and they actually put a house up here. A uh, house way up here. Um, I wonder if that's for Alwyn. Alright, so now comes the dangerous part. I'm going to go into wolf territory, as we do know. Skim the sides here. Have a quick look around. The problem is, it seems like when I find one, there's always one... You see the one that's howling, and you don't see the one that's behind you. Any wolves around? Interesting. having a quick look around to see if there's any of my arrows around here because at one point over here I was coming used, used to come over here in the dark to hunt them and then I found out you really don't have to hunt them at night even though it says night hunt well they're not here but they're going to be close I got a funny feeling and I think I'm also going to run into one it's I'm going to run into a couple but I'll have to take them all on Well, we got some deer around here. Maybe the deer killed the wolves. Over here in Baruru. <laughs> uh, Gerwin, can I help you with something? Uh, no, not really, no. Are you sure? You seem very upset. I got an argument with my wife, and now she doesn't even want to talk to me. All right, uh, we'll go talk to her. Uh, we'll find out what she wants from you. So, family dispute. Let me go ahead and get that one on up. I did not find... Uh, where is she? I did not click over. I thought I got that. There we go. Uh, this must be her right here. Hello. Uh, hello, fair lady. Hello, what do you want? Well, okay, I want to go make up... <laughs> I want you to go make up with your husband. Uh, yeah, we kind of know where this is going. Uh, okay, well, she just said, maybe you're right. Maybe I should have read that even more. Uh, usually, it's something. Continue. Tell him that I'll talk with him soon. All right, so this is not uh, something that we have to go grab something, usually. That's what it, us what it usually is all about. Uh, I'm, I convince your wife to talk with you. She wants to uh, reconcile. Excuse me, sir. I'm having a conversation over here. 
Uh, thank you very much, stranger. Here, have some coins for your trouble. No problem. 40 dynasty reputation for that. Interesting. Uh, meanwhile, on the worker front, uh, here's Albert, 82%. Um, I would love to join you, but we need a house first. I, I thought I'd give it a try. Uh, you know, we'll, we'll see if he has, how's he been lately? Okay, he likes that. Um, how's the job? Hope you're doing all right. 99%. And, uh, he's talked out. So am I, honestly. So am I. So, wait for further events. Don't we gotta go ahead and get that other one back up. Night Hunt. Let's go ahead and grab that. And actually, I'm thinking, since I'm not building anything anymore, um, hunting at night is probably not my best idea because I tried to do that once in a while and it doesn't work out too well in my favor. I am actually probably thinking, uh, just go back to the village and call it a night myself and sleep through the night. Actually, I'll go this way. There might be some boars on this side of the river between Boru and my little uh, crossway on the river on the bridge. There might be a couple of boars up here. Because if I can knock out three more, that'll just make tomorrow so much easier. But now it feels kind of weird that I maxed out on buildings. So right now it just feels kind of weird that I don't have to plan on building anything. That deer did scare the living daylights out of me just for a second. Wasn't sure what it was. Alright, let's go back to the village and see what's going on. Um, still at a... Uh, oh, that's right, he gave me some coins. That's right, he gave me coins. So I'm up to 181. So he gave me 45 coins? Seems kind of an odd number, but okay. If he gave me 45 coins, that would make sense. If he didn't, then I am making some money from the storekeeper in the food building, which I'm not quite sure. I'm pretty sure he's not selling anything because there's no way for me to set... Look at all the people that's coming out of the tavern. Um, yeah, there's no way for me to set if I go into management and go into here and go to food storage number three. Yeah, there's no way for me to change anything in there. Anything. Uh, okay, Admar. Let's go over here and see what Admar is really good at. Well, he's he's pretty good at crafting. I guess I could put him in the sewing room. I'm just trying to figure out what he could go ahead and make in there. Uh, the other thing I need to see as well as I'm in here is I haven't really been keeping track of the barn too well. So if I go in here, and of course right now they're not crafting anything. Uh, wheat grain. I don't know if they got any more wheat grain to make. I think I may have them start making some animal feed. No resources, so we're out of clay apparently. I'll have to check that when they're working so I can see what uh, what they're actually up to. But yeah, let me go ahead and... So I'm going to leave it in food storage just for now because I don't know exactly what I want to do with them. I, pr I actually got too many villagers at this point in time, I think. But let's go in here. Do we have any... I, I hope we got some daub. Actually, we got a hundred of it. And I forgot to sell my iron arrows that I had. That That's okay. We'll find a place to sell it. Uh, 15 is my weight, so we'll carry about that much. Uh, yeah, we only got one clay, so you definitely don't have enough for that. So the wheat, I got I to gotta take my wheat, and I think I actually got to put that into food storage for them to actually work the wheat. Probably the same thing with the rye, and the same thing with oats. Oats. Uh, no, I don't have any oats in here. That's fine. Uh, let me grab my hammer. And with the doll, we can go ahead and start upgrading some houses. I know I got a house over here that's like not, not quite fully done, but it almost is. So I think I'm going to work on the Dob houses on this side of the tavern first. And work my way over to Gostovia. Uh, this needs to go to upgrade. Got to make the villagers a little bit more happier. And I think this house is all done. Oh, nope, 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 nope. There's a bit over here. 
And that one's done. Slowly but surely, we'll get these houses all daubed up. Yeah, so as for someone working in food storage, I don't know exactly what they're doing. Maybe it's not implemented yet, so maybe in the future um, you can have them. Because it says store keep. Maybe in the future I'll be able to say what food can be sold, what can't be sold. And quote-unquote other villages will be going through and uh, buying things. Since my wooden hammer is almost broken, I decide not to go ahead and do anything else. But I am going to go into storage, and I'm going to grab our wheat grain, which is the wheat and rye. And I'm going to make sure that is in uh, food storage. Flax, I'm not sure if flax should be in here because it's not really a food. We'll grab all that, and we'll grab all that. Oh, I'm, I'm way overweight, apparently. That's too much. Let me go ahead and put the iron arrows in here. Oh, the iron arrows don't weigh nothing. That's not going to help you too much. Oh, you know what's weighing me down? I got a lot of this stuff on me. Uh, linen thread, we'll put that in here as well. All right, now I can move slowly. And we'll go ahead and put this into food storage up here. So, yeah, we went from... I mean, I was actually shocked. I went from 700 kilograms of storage for food up to 1,500 that we're at now. So this must be 1,000 storage, and food storage 2 must be 500. Let's slowly walk into here. Yeah, we got plenty of room. Because if I go to food, actually it doesn't show it as food. It shows it in here, but can I put it in here? I can put it in here. Uh, buckets of milk, what do they sell for? I should be taking those and selling it. Because right now, I don't really have a use for the buckets of milk. As far as I know, there is no recipe for buckets of milk. Uh, flax grain is going in here. Cabbage seed. Uh, the oats are in here. Yeah, so I gotta tomorrow when the barn's up and active, I gotta make sure that they can go ahead and do the things that they need to do. Now, I would like to go hunt some boars and stuff, but I think I'll do that in the morning. I only got to uh, take care of five more. So let me just actually come in here and prepare myself. Meaning I'll come in here. Iron arrows, 240. Yeah, I mean, they're just making tons and tons of iron arrows. I have no problem bringing in the cash. Um, I would like to see what my calf grows into if it does. I know someone said there, I guess there's an issue with the calves not growing into full cows or bulls. Uh, so, but I don't think free, I don't know if reproduction is a thing in this game yet either. Let's go ahead on to our house and, uh, I'm actually going to sleep. Sleep, sleep, sleep. I wonder if my wife is in here sleeping. Uh, my son is, yeah, there's my wife. Go ahead and have a snooze right next to her. And probably what I need to do is I need to grab some food. I was in the food storage, but I did not grab enough food for me to eat. Yep, not going to bother talking to the wife today. I'm thinking I may talk to her the first day of fall, because that's when she kind of kind of got pregnant. So maybe a year before she can get pregnant, like not pregnant again, but maybe three years in a cycle. It'll be one year since our son's been walking around is what I want to say. Uh, let me grab some pottage here for myself. Uh, two should be good for today, actually. All right, are they in? Are they in the barn working yet? So I can see what's going on here. Uh, nope, they're not in the barn as of yet. All right, we're actually going to go to Gostovia first and see what we can sell. Now, everyone over here in Gostovia might be a little bit broke. Let's see, show me your wares. No, she's got a thousand on her, so let's go ahead and I want to say steal that from her. Uh, thank you, I gotta go for now. Uh, yep, wait, is Alwyn still here? Alwyn, what are you doing here? Uh, do you have a minute? Nice weather we're having today, don't you think? Uh, yes, it's quite warm, I like that. Um, so I can't really interact with him after we kind of convinced him to be a hunter. Apparently not. Maybe future quest. 
Let's go up here and talk to... Yeah, we'll go ahead and talk to the farmer up here. Oh, he's, he takes care of the cattle, actually. Yeah, the, the guy that doesn't like me too much. I still got the meat on me, actually. You know what? Here, you can have the meat. Um, buckets of milk. Here, you can take those. And how many more iron arrows can you sell me? Or sell you? I still got 50. I gotta go now. Thanks. And how much cash do you have on you? Uh, actually, you got plenty of cash on you. There we go. I am now up to 2302. So, he doesn't like me at all, Harley. And she approves of me, I don't want to say quite a bit. So a cow, do they have any bulls? No, they do not. They do not. All right. Well, the rest of my, my day is, uh, yeah, I got to go ahead and kill five more boars, wolves, slash bears. Well, I know where I can find bears easily enough. Some wolves on the, on the way as well. I think, if I haven't killed them already this season. As for boards up in this area, not too sure, but see what we run across. I was starting to think I killed the bears up here already this season, but um, if I did, they are back. Just trying to figure out if he... Nope. See if I can uh, get his attention over here. Turn your head back this way for a second. That'll work. All right, let's see how much of a drop the crossbow has at this distance. Let's go like right about here. I guess that'll work. And that bear is like, I don't even know where that even came from. Uh, you're kind of going into the mine, which... Um, can I hit you from here? Uh, okay, you're going to go back this way. On the move. I think I missed. Wait, what? Nothing in my quiver. Probably should put one in the crossbow first, Peanut, before you head on down towards the bear. And that'll do. Let's get my arrows back, and then we'll see if I... if that arrow is still over there, or did it get destroyed. A good amount of fur and leather, I do believe, from these things. Like I said, I could put someone in the sewing room for the amount of leather and wool I'm bringing in. Not wool, but uh, fur. I don't see the iron arrow that I shot over here. Either it what did hit the bear. I didn't see how many arrows I got back from the bear. And I really should have an arrow ready to go, just in case. All right, three more to go. And I think I know where to find some boards around here. <laughs> and like always, the wolves come out of nowhere. I just heard a howl and I started doing circles here. <laughs> And he was behind me, like always, chasing me. Did not see him at all. Now I'm just looking around because at least packs of two on wolves I, I usually see. I thought it used to be packs of three, but lately when I run into wolves, it's packs of two. Two more to go. I'm just looking around. Um, yeah, I came up here to find the boars, but they're not here. And maybe they're not here because the wolves are here. 
All right, just need two more to make my villager. I even forgot uh, who had this quest. I mean, I got it, but I don't know who requested me to do this for them, but we'll take care of it. Hopefully. Well, I circled back and I see, well, you can see one as well. So I just missed them, apparently. The animals do tend to have to move to two different locations throughout the day. It's like a daytime, nighttime cycle where they move to. So just be aware of that. At least that's what I'm kind of noticing. I'm not sure if that's a thing or not, but um, I'm kind of noticing it here and there. Oh, there's my last target. Let's make this one a little bit less interesting. Actually, I almost overshot that one. And it's actually Prisabor who has this quest for us. Just going to try to do the quest we have with the villagers each season and uh, other ones if I get a chance to or if I want to. Just to build up our reputation because uh, maybe, like I said, at some point there'll be a chapter 10 for the dynasty. And we may have to hit like uh, 15,000 reputation to uh, upgrade our village so we can build more buildings. But now I'm just going to head on home, 550 meters that way, apparently. Talk to Prezabor, we'll get our arrows, a little bit of cash, I think, and our reputation. Not really back to the village just yet, but before I go any further, because I don't want to forget, because I kind of already have already, and the day is coming probably to a close here soon, I want to go back into the barn and see what's actually going on in the barn. All right, so flax grain, they're working on that. Uh, wheat grain, they're working on that. Uh, flour, they are working on that still. Daub, no resources. So let's go ahead and quit making daub for a little while. And we'll go ahead and put that into animal feed. So that's wheat grain and straw. We can go ahead and do that. Uh, let me cut down on the wheat grain by five. If I put it up to rye grain. Yeah, so putting the rye grain into the food storage they can go ahead and do that so we'll get them working on that a little bit as well and really like i think i might go ahead and do let's go to management again for a second um food storage number three admar i'm pretty sure i just looked at this a little while ago uh admar storekeeper farming not so good he is good at crafting a skill level of three I mean, do I want to put them in the sewing room? Because, I mean, I don't have that much to be worked on. And it's nothing that I can't do overnight. Uh, I mean, I, I got, I'm got i crafting things that use so much leather and fur. It's not that big of a deal. And when I want to make linen thread, doesn't take too long either. So, do I just want to throw them into the barn now to help out the people in the barn to create? We got so much stuff going on. We don't need more food. I don't need any really, like, I don't need more field workers. I think just throwing them into food storage and not really doing anything is going to help out. So, yeah, I think I may go ahead and throw him into the barn, even though he only has a skill level of one. There's one of our sheep. We should actually have three sheep around here, right? Uh, one of our chickens got out. All right, so there's one. Yeah, my animals are just running everywhere. Uh, there's another lamb. And here is another one. Yeah, our pigs are like, what's the deal, man? All the other animals get to run free and I don't? Uh, apparently not. All right, so you are you seem to get stuck here a lot, Prisabor. Uh You need some help. I got rid of the animals that you wanted gone. Uh, 25 reputation, one iron spear, 19 arrows. I noticed everyone was sleeping soundly thanks to you here for your trouble as well as something extra from me. Hey, you're welcome, sir. Um, sorry about the roof and you colliding with that all the time. And I mean all the time. All right, so what is my weight down to? I still am kind of fat, but then again, I probably got some meat and fur and leather on me. So let's go ahead and put that away. Uh, no, let's go in here. Fur. 
leather. So how much fur and leather do I have at the current stage? 39 fur, which is not much. Iron, yeah, we're staying at 228 leather. Sounds like a lot, but that I can make maybe like nine noble shoes, I think it is what I can make out of that. So, you know, it sounds like a lot, but it's not. Um, Dob, how much Dob do we have today? I don't think they made too much today because of the clay situation. Uh, logs, I'm only up to four logs. I didn't use any logs today, I swear, people. I did not use any logs <laughs> today whatsoever. Um, maybe they're making too many planks. We'll, we'll let them make some more planks for a while. And firewood, maybe they're making too much firewood. 125 firewood. What's the situation in management? Uh, so food. Uh, food, yeah. So basically, I'm going to need 500, we'll just say, just shy of 600 food per day right now. Okay, that's starting to get up there. I mean, it says I got 13,000, so it's not a big deal. Uh, wood demand, uh, we're doing fine on that. Uh, so, yeah, we're looking at, what, 110, 110 uh, wood per day? I mean, that's that's okay. We're, we're I'm fine with that. But we'll still stockpile up. It's the only summer, and I really don't have any other buildings to build. Um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know if you're going to be doing this job much longer, sir, because I can't set you do anything. All right. So what's my weight down to now? All right. I seem kind of. Oh, I got to walk right through you. Perfect. You see my weights down below ten. Oh, I know my weights high because now I got an iron spear that weighs two pounds. And iron arrows. I don't know if I want the spear for anything. Although the spear is not too bad to have. Iron arrows, I'll put those away. The iron spear, I'm actually going to put in here. Whoops, I just put something else in here. I don't know what I put in there. Um, what did I throw in there? Not too sure, but it's not that big of a deal. Uh, if it's that important... I'll find out what it is in just a moment. Let me go ahead and grab, I need one log. And I need some sticks, like 10 of them. Cause my hammer is about to break. And I think, I think, uh, yeah, let me grab some more daub. That's what I'm really here for. Uh, so like 25, so like 35 is more than enough. I think what I need to do is go back into management and let's find the smithy two. And pause, 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 pause. Yep, we gotta come down here. Uh, you're doing arrows, iron axes. Let me take that down to 10% and building hammer Actually, let's slow down on the iron iron uh, arrows. Okay, let's slow down a little bit more. There we go. That way, I'll, I'll get some iron um, building hammers throughout the day. The wooden ones are just not working for me. Speaking of, let's go ahead and build that so I can lose some weight. And if it all goes well, when this one breaks, it should just pop the uh, new one right in my hand. You know what? This one's right here. Let's go ahead and daub this one up a little bit. And upgrade. Thank you. So I know a couple people wanted me to ask me, what happens when you put a worker in storage? So right now, um, nothing. As far as I can see, since I can't have any settings for it. So, like I said, in the future, maybe they'll make it so I can, like the tavern, set it to where he sells certain food to other villagers. I assume that will be done passively, meaning I don't think anyone's actually going to come to the village to buy things. Maybe they will. I don't know. As far as I know, other people, I mean, we see the hunters and stuff walk around. As for villagers going from one village to another, they're not really doing that right as of yet. Uh, can I carry that much? 
Sure. So this is all the daub that we have left. I would like to go and get clay myself, but for what we saw and what, how much I harvest for clay, you better find a really, really good area with a lot of clay on it. And then you're not going to be able to carry that much anyway. So um, as for getting all my houses built up with daub, yes, I want to do that. Is it a necessity to rush to do so? I don't think so. Um, it's going to build up their mood a little bit, but it's not going to make or break uh, what the village is, is uh, doing. That's for darn sure. There, that house is done. That house is done. I cannot upgrade. I am still an upgrade. I cannot upgrade like the tavern with Dob or anything like that. Uh, there was a building over here. Uh, yep. Okay, way at the end that we're working on. I do believe these are all upgraded. I mean, my villagers should be pretty darn happy with the way things are going on around here. And I would think at this point, my village is probably the most populated one. As I wait for Rhysamir to gather his breath. Yes, we are maxed out on buildings. And you know what? Let's put it into this one for now. That's good. Hammer away. And so how many villagers do I got now? 28 villagers. I think that includes myself. Um, we're maxed out on buildings. We're considered a town. Taxes are not going to be too much of a problem. Food, uh, food, we're pretty well, we're pretty well up there. I actually might go in and craft some food myself the night before I pass out. Uh, but my wife is 75% happy. Uh, look at Rosalinda and Prezibor. They're 73%, just as happy as my wife. Um, uh, maybe it's a little kid running around. Even my kid's 65%. Um, you're at 61%. That seems kind of low. Maybe these are the houses I don't have the daub on yet. So yeah, 61% seems to be kind of the norm around here, I guess. But everyone's working except for the two kids, which kind of makes sense. Uh, where's Rosalinda? Okay, so now she is level 8. I was ready to say, she wasn't leveling up, it seemed like. But then again, she got pregnant, had a kid, didn't work for two years, blah, blah, blah. But now she seems to be leveling up. So, yeah, Iron Arrows, I need to cut back on making those. I mean, we're just selling those. Uh, Cash-wise, we're doing good. I don't know if I want to buy another cow as of yet because milk is not something... Although I thought I saw it somewhere in recipes. Since we're right here at the tavern, we'll go back in to Three Stooges. Hopefully, they're crafting up some things. Um, I said this might be a wine press. Someone else did... Uh, I think it was... I think Ghost Father, was it you? That may have said that he... They think it might be like an olive press, which it could be, uh, since uh, all right now olives aren't are not in the game. Neither are neither is wine, but since we got a barrel here, I guess I could store olive oil or wine. I know there's going to be beer in the future, but um, we shall see. Anyways, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, buckets of water, buckets of water. I don't see anything where it says milk. But I tell you what we should do right now. Um, is there anything that takes a lot of meat? I mean, that's roasted meat. Uh, meat tart. How much meat does that take? Two salted meat. I don't have any carrots, so I, I know that much. I probably should plant carrots somewhere. So I, I don't want to ask carrots as well. Uh, buckets of water, flour, and berries for fruit tart. Um, flour, buckets of water, and fish. Um, we know we got fish, flour, buckets of water, and dried fish. I don't think I got dried fish. Flour, buckets of water, eggs, and berries. A fruit pie does sound pretty good right now, though. Uh, let's unlock fruit pie. I do believe I got berries. All right, so that's going to be tavern number two, maybe? Okay, maybe tavern number three. Meat pie, fruit pie for four fifty. We'll go ahead and purchase that, and that's what I got, right? So I need flour, buckets of water, eggs, and berries. I don't know if my bucket of water is in there. Nope. 
on over to yeah, everyone's heading into the tavern pretty much and this is why I put one of the food storages down here um, where is my bucket of water I might be in regular storage I do need some eggs flour is not going in here is it um, it is flour doesn't weigh anything all right uh, flour buckets of water eggs and berries I should have plenty of berries. Oh, we got berries. We'll grab the berries and my bucket should be up here. Just because I'm curious what it equals for food. There's my bucket right there. I actually got two buckets. We'll grab both of them. And if I put my buckets, if I put one bucket in my hot bar, does that equal two buckets or... All right, uh, then we'll put this one in. Aha, uh -huh, so you can take both buckets. Av so you put one in your inventory, it separates them both, so you can actually have both buckets in your inventory, if that makes sense. All right, so we'll come on down to here and... Um, forgot how to do this here. Is my bucket not in my hand? Maybe that's it. I think I just filled it by hitting the left mouse. Oh yeah, uh, upper left hand corner. One bucket of water. That helps. And kneel down. Left mouse button will fill up your bucket of water. One bucket of water minus one bucket. Seems kind of weird when I do that, but okay. Uh, Wait a minute. Where, okay, the uh, bucket of water, 10 by 10. I had two buckets. Oh, no, quantity two. Okay. Uh, so it takes it back out of your inventory, which is interesting. All right, so if I come in here and if I go to pie, how many can I make? I can make four of these. Oh, 20 seconds a piece. And I have max cooking skill down as well. So I think it's 30% faster cooking. So you can kind of do some math there and figure it on out yourself. Um, we'll just sit here and cook all four as I speak and talk about what uh, we have planned next. So fall is next, obviously. Um, what do I have planned? I'm not really sure because we're pretty much done building. I could start maybe tearing down some buildings and moving things around to make it look better around here. Uh... But the problem is I can't do any of the animal pens because I can't. Uh, I, 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 if I tear, I have to tear one down before I build, which means I have no room to put the animals in. So I can't be an animal building, or I have to tear down maybe the food storage. So like food storage two, if I tear that down, I still have plenty of storage around because food storage three is one thousand kilograms. So I could tear down food storage two, and then tear down my uh, animal pens one by one and rebuild. Well, first rebuild an animal pen and rebuild, or I can just go ahead and kind of like put fences all around them. All right, as we grab our last fruit pie, right on into there, that's good. Uh, let me go in here and let's see if we go to food. So a fruit pie is nutrition value of 70. Now the sell price is only 45, which I shouldn't say only because, uh, wait a minute. Pottage only sells for what, seven? So that's actually not too bad. Uh, let's scroll on down here. Pottage, it says price of 40, but then if I go in here and click on that and then go to food, pottage. Why does, so pottage does not sell for 40, does it? I don't think so. That, that seems awfully high. I think when I go to sell, the price will be different. Hmm, interesting. But yeah, fruit pie, nutrition of 70. That is pretty darn good. I mean, carry one of those a day and you might be just fine. Uh, let's go ahead and put that back in there. Fruit pie we'll put back in there. Eggs we'll put back in there. Berries we'll put back in there. Yeah, I'm almost up to 800 uh, food storage. But I have so much raw meat and... Uh, wait, what? what's the recipe? What's the recipe for... The meat pie is roasted meats. 
but it only consumes one roasted meat. Yeah, I don't have carrots. I probably should just... Cause that's two meat, salted meats, two and two. I bet you this might be... The meat tarts might be a full... 100%. Carrots. Carrots, carrots, carrots. I, I mean, we haven't planted carrots since about, what, season two? Yeah, of course not. And I'm going to guess... I don't see no seed in here. I may have sold all the carrot seeds. Did I do that? I may have. Nope, carrot seeds. I got 59 of those. Oh, that's right. I don't need them because my workers will plant whatever. But I am thinking, though, maybe I should put my... Oh, wow. Look at the manure. Look at the manure. Maybe I need to start crafting that into some fertilizer and start selling some fertilizer instead of iron arrows. Ah, uh, yeah, we're starting to get a lot of stuff in here. A lot of stuff in inventory that I may, I, I need to start selling because, well, we, we got plenty of storage space, but what do I do all with all this stuff? I mean, eventually, like I said, I think our workers are going to need the inventory from the warehouse or the storage to do things. So... Getting fertilizer, I only got 187. I think they are making, we're making fertilizer. Uh, uh, so much still to figure out. So much more to still figure out. And I need to figure out what to do with the guy that's in food storage. I may go ahead and put him in the sewing room and just have him just start crafting some things. It'll leave me more time at night to maybe think of maybe just cooking some food and getting the food up and going. But I think that's going to do it for today, guys. Hope you guys did enjoy the episode. I do appreciate you watching as always. I'll catch you next time right here in... Medieval Dynasty, but until then, have a good one.